Hey everybody, Ray here, and uh, I just wanted to show off the new microphones that we have that uh, replace the old iPhone lapel microphones that we used to sell. And uh, the reason we replaced this is actually because uh, this is a uh, nicer microphone for a fairly similar price. Um, the differences between the old microphone and this is, well, there's a couple of differences. One is the uh, the actual uh, clip is a much better clip than we had in the old microphone. Uh, I know that doesn't sound like a big deal, but you know it really is. The other ones I thought were a little too fragile. Um, but the other thing is, is it's a great microphone. It sounds great. I think the sound quality is pretty much the same as the old one. Uh, but the difference is that one, this one actually is a six meter uh, cable. The other one was a four meter cable that we used to go with. Uh, but this one also comes with a few extra goodies that uh, the other one did not. Uh, one is it comes with a phone jack, a quarter inch here. Uh, I know not a lot of people use these anymore, but if you happen to use uh, DJ equipment or something like that, that may come in handy. And of course, it just you know attaches over. And there you go. And now you can plug it into a mixing board or something of that nature. And um, as you can see, this is a three prong, just like the old one. So this one works in a phone. Uh, just plugs into the phone jack, the uh, headphone jack, mic jack, and so now you can record using this lapel microphone. If you happen to be somebody who shoots with an iPhone or an Android phone, well, now you have the ability to uh, have a nice microphone plugged into that. Okay, but the great thing about this, and this is what the other one did not do, is this is also an electric uh, condenser mic, and you can see here that the uh, condenser mic, actually you put a battery into it here. Okay. And this is our battery. So all you do is stick the battery in there. Like so, possibly, oops. Okay. And close it back up. And the reason that we do this is because uh, this microphone, unlike the previous one, actually will work not only with the smartphones, but it will actually work on a uh, regular video camera. So a DSLR or a video camera that has a mic input, all you do is switch this to on, and it turns on the condenser there. And so now you can actually plug this into a regular camera. So you essentially get two microphones in one, as this will work inside your phone, or it'll work inside a regular camera. Uh, the reason this is great is because now you only need one camera, no matter what your source is. Uh, you know, if you happen to be using your phone, great. If you happen to be using a regular camera, great. You can use it for either of those, and uh, you know that's going to save you quite a bit of money because before, if I wanted to shoot with my iPhone, I had to bring the one microphone and then I had to bring a condenser mic for the cameras or wireless. Uh, but in the case of a condenser, we're talking about another, you know, uh, forty dollars or so for a nice long corded uh, condenser mic. So essentially, you'd have to carry two microphones, and of course, with this, you now have it in one for one low price, and you don't have to worry about that. And uh, like I said, it, it comes with a longer cord, comes with a better clip, comes with your phone jack, it also comes with a windscreen, and has the uh, ability to work in cameras or in your phone. And uh, let's do a little bit of a sound test so we can get an idea of what this will sound like. Okay, so right now I'm uh, standing about um, eh, maybe like a foot and a half, maybe two feet away from the Canon camera. Uh, it's a DSLR, and I'm just using the microphone that's built into the camera itself. And as you can probably hear, it doesn't sound too good. And I'm going to switch now to the lapel microphone so you can hear the difference. Okay, so now I'm using the lapel microphone, and hopefully you can hear a difference uh, compared to the on-camera microphone. And uh, after this, we're going to switch to the iPhone, and we'll let you hear what that sounds like as well. And here's me recording a video using Filmic Pro. And I'm just using the built-in iPhone microphone, uh, you know, just the one on the side of the, uh, the bottom of the phone, not a plug-in mic of any kind. So uh, you can probably hear it pretty echoey and, and doesn't sound too great. So now I'm going to plug in the microphone. 
Okay, so now I'm recording audio using the lapel mic inside an iPhone. Uh, I'm using an app called Filmic Pro to record the video. So hopefully you can hear the uh, sound quality. It does sound pretty good. Uh, so there you go. That's the uh, microphone being used for the iPhone as well as for a video camera.